Good morning, y'all. So it's Friday, the day before the wedding. Oh, it's like eight in the morning. Um, yesterday was crazy, it was stressful. Uh, it was just very, very long. And I was up at 4.30 to start my day so I can get my hair done. And then um, I ended up getting, me and my mom got our eyebrows done and she did like henna. So that took a couple hours and then I did mine, but I just got mine like arch and shaped. And then I had to go um, run to the bank and pay our venue. And then everything was set up to look so nice. And then um, after that, then we came home and Dennis had just got off work. So we went to go pick up his tux. And then, uh, oh, then I had to pick up my dress later that night. And then I went to go see my dad. So we got home at like, it was after midnight when we got home. So, I was trying to sleep a little longer, but I can't. I'm up. We're going to get our nails done. Me, my sister-in-law, Bella, and my mom are going to go at 9. The shop opens at 9.30, so we we the first people in the door. So, I need to... I think I'm going to put my contacts in and wear them all day. So, I can, like, get used to wearing them for a really long time for tomorrow. And then I'm a little nervous because I'm about to get some nails. But I'm going to make sure they're, like, like real short. So it's not too bad when I put them in Saturday. Um, and then after nails, I have to go with my mom to pick up the rental like van that all the bridesmaids and me were going to get in. So we can go from the hotel to the venue on Saturday. And then I have, I still got to do my bridesmaids gifts and stuff. And, and it's in our DJ something. Um... I need to go to my dad's house. I was over there yesterday and I left all the stuff that I need to bring. Our wedding favorites are over there. I need to go get those. Um, yeah, and some other stuff. I made it like a whole other list. I have like several. Um, so I have to do all that. And then we have rehearsal at 4, 4 to 5 in our venue. And then we have dinner from five to, from 7 to 9.30 at our hotel in the conference room we need to order food this morning that's another thing um and then so like yesterday let me tell y'all because i really just oof, i was i was over this wedding over it so like we switched our whole our whole plan now so like we had our reception in our ceremony in the same place in the same room and we went there yesterday and like so how they set it up is you have our t our tables are like around the dance floor and then on the dance floor they have like the white chairs so it's like a wedding aisle right through the middle and it looks more like a ceremony than like the reception and so we got there and like they didn't have enough long story short they didn't have enough chairs in the middle so like everybody couldn't fit in that area and then there were some other issues we were talking about and stuff so Last minute decision we changed and now we're doing our ceremony upstairs in the chapel, which was our original plan last year, but we just kind of scratched that because it was just, it was easier to do all in one room. So now we're back to that. And so, yeah, so the first part will be upstairs and then they'll go downstairs to the reception. And yeah, me and my dad, we practiced our day daughter dance yesterday. It was so cute. Um, yeah, so I guess I should start getting ready for the day because it's going to take me like 30 minutes just to put my contacts in just by itself that's a whole situation so <laughs> you do you have anything to say sir i'm gonna watch you do it for my contacts yeah come here huh let's do one of this you got to say good morning or something good morning <laughs> too early for this <laughs> Y'all, yeah, today has been so stressful. Like, it's the day before the wedding. I told myself I was gonna be calm and just, you know, just go with, go with the flow. And it just became chaotic so quickly. And I'm over here 
trying to eat real fast so I can do the other things I need to do. But, like, I got a nose on. My nose look so bomb, so cute. My toes are all white, simple. We were a little late, but we were still the first people in there, so that was fine. Then, so then, I had to go pick up the rental, and like the rental people kept calling us, talking about calling my mom. She, they called her when we were at home before we left to get our nails done, talking about, and they was talking about how they don't have a car we're supposed to get, right? So. Then we try to get a different car. Call back. Can't get that. We did this like three times, I think. And they kept saying we got to get a new car. Then they called us again on the way there. It was like 15 minutes away. The car got recalled or something. We couldn't get it. And so then like it became a whole. So then that became a whole thing. We get to the place talking to these people. My mom. Um, they were offering us a minivan, which we didn't want. Cause I was like a stalker mom type of vehicle and we wanted something nice for the wedding. So they showed us two cars. One car had a dent in it. The other car is stank. It smelled like cigarettes or something, some type of smoke. And we don't want that smell on my dress and stuff. So anyway, we're going back and my mom's going back and forth with these people. We're looking at all the cars or whatever. It's hot outside. It's hot. I'm like over it. And my mom, she's going back and forth with these people, whatever and stuff. Anyway, um we ended up with the minivan you know at this point whatever and so she took the minivan she had to go take care of some stuff i drove home i had to stop and get some mcdonald's on the way because i'm starving and i knew if i didn't get food right now i would not be eating until our rehearsal dinner which is at seven o'clock and it is like two o'clock right now and you know i'm already in like not the best mood so i need some food to keep me going because this is just it's too much for me so if any of y'all ever planned a wedding, I'm sure you can understand what the stress I'm going through right now because, uh, and so now, Dennis is with my brother and Dennis is getting his hair cut. Then they're going to come here and we're going to start packing up the car so we can go. So we need to be at the venue from 4 to 5 for rehearsal. Um, So at 2.30, I need to be doing my gifts because I don't, I'm going to do them tonight. And so I need to like pack them. I need to write my like my letters letters to everybody. So at two thirty, I want to give myself thirty minutes, two thirty three to. I'm gonna start with my letters first because that's gonna take me the longest. So I can like think about what I want to say to all my friends and to Dennis and my parents and stuff. And then once I write the letters, I'm about to just be boxing, boxing, boxing. So I'll show y'all. Um, I'm trying to show y'all what I got everybody stuff like that. But I'm gonna be you know rushing. And I have a box for Dennis, so I, I want to get his done before he gets here. Even though he does know he, he's getting a wedding gift, but I don't want him to see what it is by accident. So I'm going to finish eating, and then I'll check in with you guys later. Yeah, this is our room for tomorrow. Oh. Yep, so all y'all will be up there with me and Dennis. And then, yeah. <laughs> 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 
Well, that's too bad. <laughs> So, yep. Got the ring. The only other thing is you have a microphone. Then Jordan has a microphone. Because I don't know if Jordan will have a microphone. I stand. Okay. I was not prepared, y'all. So I just want to toast to the happy, beautiful couple, Dennis and Taylor. Taylor. You've been my number one for like the past, Game. what, 10, 12 years yep. now. <laughs> and Bad. I'm so happy that you and Dennis are living life. <laughs> and <laughs> I, this is, I don't know what to say, y'all. Um, <laughs> it'll be a great day tomorrow. I'm so happy for y'all. Um, we're wishing you blessings upon blessings of many happy years together in this marriage. Mm -hmm. And cheers to... Dennis and Taylor. You done so bad. That's so bad. That's how I looked at my bridal shower. I was like, I don't know. Emma, you want to say anything next? Sure. Yeah. Exactly. So, cheers to the beautiful couple in their day. It was really awesome watching guys really blossom while she was in grad school working her Facts. butt off and you guys worked through it together and it was great to see guys work through all of those hard times. Well, not really hard, but school's hard. <laughs> so hard times together and you guys are always had each other's backs. So cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Yeah. Right, well, <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much what they said. <laughs> but yeah, um, so Taylor and I know each other from grad school. Um, but yeah, as soon as the first time I met Dennis, I know, well, they've been for together years before. But I knew that they were great together. Um, and then when Dennis asked me about helping with the proposal and everything, and Taylor already knew it was going to happen. But <laughs> and I had to act like it wasn't going to happen, so that way she wasn't, or I had to act surprised. Um, but yeah, you guys are great together. Hashtag goals. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, cheers. Thanks. Cheers, Taylor. And Ruth Dan was the one responsible for Taylor and Dennis' picture that they put on a not correct. Oh, you yeah, my engagement oh. pictures.
I said good. Good. All right, here we go. I just want to raise a salute to my best friend of many years, Dennis and Taylor. You guys, for as long as I've known y'all, they've been only good to each other. I have never seen one bad moment with them. And even if they have bad moments, they know how to keep it. Keep it moving. They know to keep it moving, and that's what a, a good relationship is about. You know, through trials and tribulations and working to overcome them. And I have no doubt that they'll be the same, if not even better than their marriage. So, salute to y'all and many years to y'all. Alright. Hello, y'all. My name is Jalen. Um, I don't know what to say about this man. Uh, um, yeah, me and this. I've been on this like since like seventh grade. We've been a homie since the longest. Like even like my own personal, my own personal brother. I haven't had no brother, so he's like the closest one I know from a brother. So, and like I'm real proud of him. Okay, so I need to get my all my gifts together so that I can do this tonight. At least I might get Vince's in the morning. Um, I'm not sure yet. But I think my girls, since we have to get up super early, it might be better if they get theirs tonight, especially since there's just gonna be a lot going on tomorrow. These are some complicated boxes. Oh well, it's not gonna be perfect, but it'll be all right. So, do all my bridesmaids. I think I'll just get all the boxes together first and then I will work on all right y'all so finally got all of the um all of my uh letters done so now let's hurry up pack these boxes it's almost it's almost 11 so i want to spend some time with my friends before i pass out and go to sleep so let me hurry up and do this so i can give them their gifts and then we can hang out for a little bit so first i'm gonna put food set our colors are royal blue and silver, so of course I have to get the blue and then silver boxes. Very cute. So I'm going to put shreds in all of the boxes to start. And hopefully I have enough. Cause I think I might do my bridesmaids. Maybe I do them separately so that I can do my bridesmaids by themselves and then my mom can do hers by herself. And her, she has different things in them. So I don't know, we'll see what happens. Okay, I think that's enough. I'm giving everybody. Okay, let's pack that. One bridesmaid. Two bridesmaids. Three bridesmaids. And four bridesmaids. Okay. Next, let's do the wine. So I got these little bottles of Moscato. And I got Dennis a blue one. 
he drinks like hard liquor but i figured i could still get him one just to be cute and it's a blue top so i didn't want to give him the pink ones so let's pack those in here give him just the blue one Maybe I'll do, yeah. Okay. Right. About chocolate. Yeah, everybody put some dough. Chocolate, just gonna toss them in there. For, you know, a little treat. <laughs> This is sitting in the car. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good. They're good. Okay, so I'm just gonna toss in. I do like four. Only two, three, four. Four for four bridesmaids. That seems one, two, three, four. dad a box too so and my stepmom so maybe I'll give him three pieces of candy so that I can have some for my stepmom and my dad's box because I don't want theirs to look super empty right, so three for everybody Mother of the Bride will be this one. I do. Oh, I don't have a box for me. So we'll put Ruth in there. Ooh, is it going to fit though? Hold on now. There we go. show you what one looks like so got it all oops got it all ouch all packed here let me grab the camera all packed real cute so that's what i'm about to give them oh i also have robes for them um that is in my room so i will grab those and i'll probably just have it laid out because it's not gonna fit in here so i'll set that up when i go in my room so then let's put all of the cards in each one. Okay, so Emma, Ruthann, Vanessa, Bella, and Dennis. Wow. Also, it's going to be like 
the same. Oh, Lord of the, Lord of the Bride. <laughs> Got my own little special cute card. Oh, vanilla candle, uh-huh. Mm, smells good. Mm, very good. <laughs> Is this y'all vanilla scent or no? Uh-uh, that's a different one. Okay. And y'all, y'all, y'all things look cute. Mom got a gift card? What? Yes. You owe me nothing. I got some chocolates in yes. here. Chocolates in here. Oh, isn't this cute? Chocolates in here. I ain't thinking And then what's the sale? I can't see. This one. Oh, 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 what is it? Moscato. Oh, this is cute. Oh, these babies so cute in the morning. These are pretty. Oh, uh, oh. Well. Oh, my God. Well, I know what we got, but. <laughs> you already know. These are pretty. Oh, from just oh, looking at y'all. Oh. We were talking about how we didn't have necklaces this morning. Yes, but Vanessa was asking me, I'm like, don't buy nothing, just, just wait. I was like, what jewelry should I bring? And she's like, don't worry about it. You yeah. didn't say anything guys earlier either. Because we were talking to you about too. We're like, we didn't bring any jewelry. I honestly don't recall that. <laughs> really? I do not. Maybe I was going down to sleep. I, <laughs> I brought some just in case, but this yeah. is way better. This is way better. Yeah. Wow. This is cute. Wow, we could totally drink some champagne in the yeah. afternoon. Somebody else said that too. Who? It was you who said it. Who, who I said it was the same. I think it was me. Oh, because I was like, it'll be a good idea if we had. So yeah, yeah. It's on the fridge too. Thank you. 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 Thank you.